Hello Taurus and welcome to Taurus Truth Tarot where we are all Taurus all the time. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. My name is Shannon Colleen and I am a Taurus Sun and Venus. Before we get started, I want to thank you. I want to thank you, thank you, thank you for supporting this channel. Um, the more times we get likes, the more times you guys comment on these, uh, the more it gets out to fellow Taurus, right? And that's what we want. We want all Taurus to do well. So don't forget to hit the like button and put in a comment. I read each and every one. And thank you for supporting me uh, monetarily. You guys have been given lots of donations through that little heart. Thank you so much through PayPal. Sometimes I don't know who they're actually from, especially through PayPal, because your na your real names aren't on there. So this is my opportunity to say thank you. I would not be able to do what I do without that. And also, another gratitude message real quick. Thank you for the beautiful reviews on your personal readings. You guys put the most beautiful reviews uh, on my booking site page for personal readings. And I can't thank you enough. It Literally, you all make me blush. And sometimes you make me tear up. So thank you. I love you guys. You're the best. All right, let's get into it, my loves. Let's get into it. Divine Source, I feel like I need a little light here. Ooh, that's a lot. Okay, Divine Source Creator, <laughs> what is the overall energy for this reading? Show us clearly what is the overall energy. Thank you. Wow. Oh, I love this. Oh, I love this so much. And I, I got to show you guys. Hold on. We've got the personal choice card here. And it says, close your eyes. What animal do you imagine? What strengths are they known for? What wisdom do they share? And then embrace these qualities. I'm going to tell you why I love this. I've never seen this card in this deck. I've had this deck forever and I have never seen it. It's like all your challenges are going to be uh, melted away, right? This mountain almost feels like a glacier, like it's going to melt away here, right? Like obstacles are being removed. And the reason I'm so like just astounded, because again, I've had it, but this is the Spirit of the Animals Oracle. I didn't even know there was a card in here. All the other cards are truly animals, right? Cougar, squirrel, a moose, right? Bottom of the deck, I'm loving this. This is funny. I love this. Um, is if you do the personal choice, right? You have choice. You always have choice. Every single situation, you have a choice. Um, you make good choices, and we've got the ladybug good luck spirit underneath, right? You are, or if I could read, you are a bright energy. Let worry go and be happy here and now. Feel good about being a loving and colorful you. You bless the world with color and good luck. Taurus, if you didn't think you were special, you are. Sorry, that's going to make me crazy because my fleur de -lis just was on there. I don't know how that got down there. Anyway, so make the choice. Um, that should be your mantra. I really feel like that should be your affirmation or mantra for the day, for the week, for the month, for the year is um, I choose good luck. I choose good luck. Okay, I choose good luck. Good things always happen to me. Serendipitous things happen to me, right? I, I choose it. I just choose it. And I just feel like that's going to set you forth into where uh, you will start seeing things happen that will be a, maybe a little bit of a surprise. You'll be like, whoa, this works. I choose good luck. That is beautiful. And believe it or not, <laughs> I don't know why they're having me tell this. I actually do uh, have... You see how this ladybug is almost orange? Okay, orange is the sacral chakra, passion. Passion, love, passion for what we do, passion, romantic passion, right? I actually have an orange ladybug tattooed on my leg. I've had it for a bazillion years, 20 years or so, right? So I think this is a reminder for you and a reminder for me that good things happen. That good things happen to Taurus. I love this. All right, let's see what we have here. Angels, guides, ancestors, what is the message, please? What, if I can hold on to the cards, what is the message? Thank you. First card out we have here 
is the Page of Pentacles. I'm telling you, good luck is happening. You're going to hear some sort of news. Pages are about news. And whatever it is, right, it, it's, it's there to stay, right? Our energy, Pentacle energy, Earth energy, it's there to stay, okay? So something very uh, long-term or permanent is coming in for Taurus that feels like luck. I love it. Show me clearly. What is it? Thank you. Wow. With the star card? Yeah. Okay, the star can talk about healing after, uh, it comes right after the tower, like a healing moment. But I'm not even getting that, Taurus. I am getting, wow, what a surprise. What a great wish fulfillment. You know, this is, I'm not advocating anybody to do this, okay? I'm not necessarily, I'm not really a gambler. Um, but it would like, let's keep it, well, we don't have to keep it. It's like winning some sort of lottery here. That's what the feeling is. Like, it, Okay, I'm not telling anybody to do this. Disclaimer, I am not telling anybody to do this. But I was once at a gas station years ago, and they had the big, it looked like, it's it's like a vending machine for scratch-off tickets, right? And I don't buy those. I don't really even buy a lottery ticket that often. I mean, every once in a while I might. But I had this feeling. I was like, just go. So I paid for my uh, water that I was buying and my snack, and... As I was walking out, I stopped at the machine and I just looked at it and I threw 20 bucks in and randomly just, you know, whatever caught my eye, picked at those and I have no idea why I did it. I just did. Right. And so I scratched off and I think it was like $10 worth of tickets or $20 worth of tickets, whatever it was. I can't remember that part, but I do remember getting to the second to the last one and I hadn't won anything. Right. And I thought, God, this is a waste of time and money. And sure as shit, that second to last lottery ticket, I won 250 bucks. Nothing to sneeze at, right? So I'm not advocating that, but that's just how I feel. Like this is kind of a, a surprise, a surprise wish fulfillment. This could be like getting that parking spot or maybe you put a bid in on eBay or something, you know, and you get it. I don't know. Different for all of you, but very cool. Show me clearly, please. Thank you. Yeah, look at this. You're manifesting it. You are truly manifesting it because you're making choices to have good luck. That is manifestation right there. That's a magician. I choose good luck. Wow. Look at the major arcana. It's like once you decide, it's like, okay. The universe is like, all right. <laughs> okay. Okay, Taurus. Show me clearly. What is the message for Taurus right now, please? What is, okay. Okay. Yeah, wow. Ooh, King of Swords, I like this. That has been very decisive, okay? That's very de decisive energy of saying just what we're choosing, right? I choose good luck. I choose happiness. I choose X, Y, Z, right? And you just get real clear. It's almost like you're demanding it from the universe. You're like, hey, I choose this. Therefore, you must give it to me. Wow. All right, Taurus, we'll take it, right? We will take it. All right, let's see what else we have here. Oh, I thought that was coming out. Look at the success and the speed of this. Holy moly, look at all this major arcana, big shift in energy, right? That is when life changes, when we have a lot of major arcana. The chariot, again, would be fast success. You could win a trip. Maybe you put some, you know, something in. You know, and you win a, a cruise or whatever. But I don't know, Taurus. I like it. I like it a lot. I choose good luck. I choose love. I choose happiness. I choose success. I choose, I choose, I choose. I love this. Ooh. Some of you need to look up uh, the number 1717, angel number 1717. Find the one that resonates with you because we have the 17 card here and then they just showed me one seven. So that is another sign from your angels, guides, and ancestors. It will, the message is pretty much the same anywhere you go, but one will, you know, resonate more than another. So make sure it resonates with you. Look that up, Google it. Show us clearly what is going on here. Thank you. All right. Oh, my nose is itchy. Oh. Oh, sorry, guys. <laughs> sorry, my nose is itching like crazy. I love that we have the hermit here because what is he holding? The star. Okay, the hermit. 
goes off to figure out what they want, what their desires are. We all have hermit times. Sometimes it's a few hours. Sometimes it's, you know, it can be a few months where we're just like working on us and doing our thing and what do we want? But I love, they're like, it's right there. Your wish is right there. That is beautiful. And look how happy that little sloth is. Oh my gosh. <laughs> right? Again, one, two, three, four. Lots of success here. I think it's just when you make the choice because the hermit would be a card of I'm making the choice because I'm pulling back. What do I really desire? What do I really want? And I think that if you just choose good luck and you just choose to embrace those qualities, it happens for you. <laughs> it happens for you, Taurus. All right, let's see what else we have here. Angels, guides, ancestors, show us clearly. Show us clearly. What is the message? What is the message? Surprises. I, I love it. I told you. Remember I said it with the star card and I was telling about the lottery ticket? Like it was kind of a, wow, 250 bucks. All right, cool. Surprises. Venture down the rabbit hole. There are surprises waiting for you, um, which is so lovely to see. So lovely to see. This can come in so many forms, guys. But, um... Yeah, let me know in the comments. <laughs> Come back to this, and I would tell you, if you step into this energy, you'll have very, very happy surprises. Happy surprises. So, choose good luck. With that being said, all my love, light, and blessings to you. Until next time.